Hi, good morning. Uh, Chuck McCown here. I'm going to show you the uh, method of repairing the uh, the plastic lens on a Fluke 97 meter. If you, I don't know if you can see this. You have to look. It's got some pretty messed up areas on it. We make the uh, these little replacement lens, and so you just pull off your little rubber bump guard, take the take the the uh, leads off, and then there's just three screws in the back and of course I always use the the best tool for any job which is always the Leatherman tool and it's really a lot simpler than you would think to change the lens just remove the three screws and then uh, then the whole case separates um, and it's got a kind of a rubber gasket going around it so it may feel like it's stuck together but it's not it's just really tight to keep keep the rain out of it and so forth these things are really made well so then you have to kind of like get fingers in there or something sometimes I use a knife blade I think that's probably what I'm going to use today um, some of them will pop right apart oh they're starting to go okay so this is going to come right apart and the uh, the actual LCD display stays with the meter. The only thing you have out here is you have this conductive rubber pad of, of buttons, which you might want to wash before you got it apart. And then the knob. Now you want to make sure that the knob uh, uh, stays in one position. If it, if if it 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 will stay in one position, but but this can get out of out of sequence there. You can actually turn it on by rotating it with your finger there. It's got a little tiny little bitty pointer, so if you don't know if it's pointed in the right place, you can look at the pointer and now it's, it's set to off. You don't have to worry about any of this. I've got a, I've got a method of uh, fixing these things too if they're showing just partial segments. So here's the old lens here, and uh, maybe you can see now uh, that it's not looking as good as it did when it was new. So these things come out pretty easy that's about all there is to taking one out you might want to take a blade and scrape any of the glue out that's in that channel um, this one came out really really clean essentially no residue down in there a little bit of uh, solder from somebody and then I use a particular kind of solvent type cement, um, but uh, I'll tell you, super glue, especially the gel type super glue, um, actually works just as good, if not better. And then you just drop the new lens down in there, and there you have it. That's that's all there is to it, to uh, repairing your fluke voltmeter, making it look like new again. Put your buttons back in if you took them out and just reassemble it in the reverse order I don't think this has taken me more than than two minutes so thanks for buying lenses from us